All right, YouTubers, we are super excited about this item. Um, not the most expensive uh, blunder, and uh, definitely by far not the most expensive. But uh, what I am excited about is uh, making some milkshakes, maybe some smoothies, maybe some kind of uh, fruity drink, if you know what I mean. So let's go ahead and get this uh, open. This is available at uh, Walmart, Amazon, all kinds of other places, probably Target. And it's about $24.99, I think. The next one up by Oster was uh, $39.99. Had a bunch of other uh, speeds that it would do. So wasn't uh, feeling that was necessary. Actually, before I open it, let's take a look at the box. Different stuff you can make. I have to back this up a little bit. Blends, crushes, purees, soup, sauces, salsas. I love salsas. Banana smoothies, marinara sauce. And looks like the front and the back are the same. Then uh, power boost. It starts with 700 watt, 700 watts and then blends continuous at 450. So I guess it uses a bunch of power to get it break, broken up in the beginning. Crush Pro 4 blade, stainless steel four point design, pulverizing chops with precision. Five speeds. Well, that's much better than the last one I had. Different ways to make it fresh from pulse to puree. Six cup boro class glass jar, thermal shock tested, stain and odor resistant, BPA free, and dishwasher safe. So, speaking of the jar, that's where my last um, blender failed. Uh, it started leaking. Every time I'd make something, it would leak at the bottom, make a mess. Two ounce filler cap, built in markings to measure and pour ingredients while blending. Satisfaction guarantee, three year satisfaction guarantee, and 10 year Duralast all metal drive limited warranty. So, as if anybody's going to remember that 10 years later, right? Um, yeah, I think I bought, so I bought this at Walmart. They offered me a warranty, which I think their warranty was like, good be almost half the price of this thing so uh black and white this is like this must be a really old model um there is your instruction manual and uh it looks like an old newspaper this is definitely old style they have not uh, converted over to uh the future so there's some blending tips in here using your blender, yada, yada, yada. Uh, I probably won't read that because I think I'm an expert on everything. So, all right, let's get this thing out of here. Let's hopefully not break the glass container. So, one thing at a time, folks, one thing. And pop that off, so there's the lid. We don't do things gentle on here. So this uh, this is some seriously cheap plastic, folks. I don't know. That's not as nice as the last Oster. Um, Spanish. English. Do not put liquids in the jar first and then add remaining ingredients. Liquid to solid ratio is key. Add more liquid if ingredients are not blending properly. Bonus tip. Okay, so there's a reason to read this. And there's the glass, which uh, makes this thing solid. That's a nice piece of glass, folks. I will say. Um, so hopefully this thing will seal nice and tight on there. And... Alright, so there's that part. There's... Cheap, uh, cheap lid. So the other two components actually look nice, and unfortunately, this lid looks like crap. All right. So what else do we have? We should have the actual blender coming up, and some cardboard. Things are not going to be easy to get out of here. Alright, 
so let's uh, let's rotate down here so you can see everything. Hopefully, Let me make sure I didn't miss anything out of the box because it wouldn't be much of an unboxing video if we didn't get everything right. I think I've done that before. And later I've gone back to go, oh, I forgot something. All right, so there it is. Um, yeah, this is dusty. So here's the little uh, measuring device that goes on top here. And we'll turn that that way. Hopefully that won't leak. So I'm not so sure about the quality of this. I am wondering if I should have gotten the warning. You know, might be buyer's remorse. Uh, if not, we'll go buy the, the next model up. Actually, looks a lot better. So there's your settings, folks. Easy clean, milkshake, cream, smoothie extract, and ice crush. So we'll be using this one mainly. And the smoothie one. All right, looking it over, there's your, uh, I don't know if that's a fan. Must be a fan. Um, really looks like cheap plastic. I can't tell you that this does not look like it's made in America anymore. And if I can get if I can get the light right, we will figure out where it's made. Alright, we're gonna have to go to our other device over here. I'll be back. Just so I can tell you guys. Oh, wow. Assembled in Mexico. Our friends from uh, down south put this together. So, because they're our neighbors and we, uh, we don't have anything against those guys, I'm not going to say what I think of the quality of this. So, good job, everybody. Oster, go buy yourself one of these. I think you'll be sort of happy. All right. Thanks for checking out the video. Please like, please subscribe.